Great to be back to answer some more Twitter questions. Uh, ACJ List asked, what was the, because of our schedule in pro football, the strangest family tradition we've had to adopt? And uh, it is crazy during the fall and the winter, you know, with Thanksgiving, you're always practicing or playing a game, Christmas, New Year's Day. Uh, and what we had to do, uh, especially on Christmas, we always let the players decide, and most of them wanted to practice first and then get back and spend the rest of the day with their family. So uh, we started having the, the early time be work time and not open our presents until later on in the day. And, and our family has still continued that, even though I'm not coaching. Uh, we kind of wait, uh, do our, our gift opening in the afternoon because that's what our, our kids became used to. Philly Back Bro asked, what do I miss most about coaching anymore? And uh, I'll tell you, there, I had a great time and, and loved every minute of coaching, but really the thing I miss is the relationships. Uh, you're around 53 players, 15 other coaches, staff people, the guys in the equipment room, the trainers, and, and just missing all the, those relationships, not getting to talk to people and find out what's going on in their lives, uh, not being out there uh, at one o'clock in the afternoon for practice on a, on a nice fall day. That's definitely what I miss the most. Faders23 asks, what was it like working with Peyton Manning? And, and people want to know that now that he's going to Denver and, and starting on a, on a new career, tell me what Peyton Manning was really like. And uh, i tell you what, it was fantastic. Uh, one of the hardest working guys I've ever been around, very prepared, very meticulous. But a, as a coach, you had to be detailed because Peyton wanted to know exactly what we were doing, what the game plan was, and uh, you know he didn't want any surprises. But it, it, was, it was great working with somebody who was so dedicated and who was such a good teammate. He wanted everybody else to be prepared as well. So definitely enjoyed it. The one thing people might not realize if they just see him on TV is that Peyton Manning really does have a great sense of humor. He was probably the biggest practical joker on the team. So as a coach, you always had to be on the lookout for that. Make sure he wasn't playing one of those practical jokes on you.